this is Xander and welcome back to another uh, Minecraft video. And today we are going to be playing a new series, actually. It is a uh, modded adventure series called uh, Blightfall. I haven't seen too much of this online lately, so I'm hoping it's a very nice, almost uh, kind of original uh, thing for the uh, channel. And this will probably be one of our first videos uh, of many back to uh, bringing my channel back to a bit of activity. So um, today I'm joined in Blightfall by um, L9X2000, also known as Lucas. Um, what is up? Yeah, there he is. And we were also joined by Fazbear, uh, who if you follow any of my streams, you may know who he is. Um, but for whatever reason, he's been crashing quite a bit. So if you look in our chat, we just lost him like a minute ago. But nonetheless, uh, here we are. Uh, we're going to be starting without him, sadly. He's probably going to come back in a bit throughout the uh, series. If you guys are wondering some funny... Exactly. Like, yeah, if you guys are wondering about some funny things happening with audio, uh, what that is, is we actually have Mumblelink uh, installed, um, meaning that as I move around Lucas or he moves around me, the audio comes from where he is in game. Um, and also it gets quieter and louder based on our positions, which is, uh, gonna add a bit of added realism to the, uh, to the series. If you're familiar with, uh, SMP live, you may have seen that before. Regardless, I think we should probably get right right into the story, because this one takes a while. But yeah, welcome to episode one of uh, Blightfall. So, this person here has been bugging us for the uh, past, I don't know, 20 minutes while we were setting up to uh, talk to them. So I do believe we should um, should talk to them. So, Mirabelle says, just step into one of these pods to get started. If you're on a team, make sure to use the same drop pod as the rest of your team. Okay. So, I don't believe... Yeah, she's talking about pods. Um, so, pod alpha, because we have two teams here. Two teams of three people. Uh, we are team beta, so we're going to be dropping on team... Um, on pod beta which is uh, Savannah, and it's a little bit more difficult than what um, Team Alpha is going to be dealing with, which is a uh, grassland. Um, other than that, let's see what advice they have. Uh, hunger is going to be a problem, so try not to run or jump. Build stairs to conserve energy if we mine. Uh, the purple biomass will hurt us if we step on it, but will not kill us if we stay well fed. So make sure to go on the scouting expeditions to impress the leadership. You can use the goodwill to requisition food later if you get in a tight spot. So seriously, they expect us to ask for food. There's no shame in it. Speaking of that, don't forget to ask Driscoll for seeds whenever possible. You need to keep your diet varied. Two stacks of bread doesn't a healthy diet make. Okay. Let's see, anything else? Not a whole lot. If you can manage to get food controlled, then you can use the um, old tried and true base development principles you know and love. I hear you're an expert at that sort of thing. Branch mining, high density farming, combat against the undead and explosive monsters. We hide the best, right? Well, not so confident in that one. Uh, what's our book? Yeah, the book is the way that we communicate with the crew on board the Jaded. That's where we are right now. So, you can look at it by right-clicking with it in your hand. Uh, with it, you can receive assignments from the scientists and officers on the Jaded and Fulfill. Okay. So, let's say thanks, bye. And I think this is Drop Pod Beta. Lucas is yes, already in is. here. Yeah, there we go. And let's right-click. You'll be assigned to Team Beta, likely Team Alpha... Like Team Alpha, you are in a fertile biodome. Um, proximity to helpful alien ores and jungle makes early progression easier. A nearly ruined village may provide both a source of aggressive alien intrusion and foraging opportunities. You will be dropped on the western edge of the continent. Okay, let's proceed. If 
Very well, initiating Wait. transport. Here we go. Okay, I'm in here. You're gonna have to go through the prompts, I believe. Okay, so we're in our biodome. Is there anything in here? There's just a bunch of quest books, so let's sort those. We don't need those. Okay, so first things first, I believe we should probably look into the quests we have. They've, they've given us some water. Uh, this beautiful tree is here. And some beds. Okay, well, let's see what our first quest is. We've died zero times. Mission outlook is concerned. Dark one's impression curious. I wonder who the dark one is. Hmm. Okay, let's show our quests. So we have the instructor, so I think we should start that. Hello, my name is Dr. Fairchild, and I've been instructed to, well, instruct you. My task will teach you the basics on how to survive on this alien planet. Uh, they should be easy to complete and give you a good foundation for further exploration. Okay, so he has six quests. So, what is this thing? Uh, this device, in addition to letting you communicate with the uh, leadership of the Jaded, can also transmit items to us by breaking them down into data and beaming them to us. So it seems that this thing beams items to them somehow. Um, you can also re receive items from them the same way. Okay. Try sending them a dirt block by breaking one nearby and submitting it. Okay. So if you grab a dirt block, I think you can submit that and complete the quest for us. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to move on to the next one. Okay, yep. There we go. And that would have unlocked more. Okay, requisition. You're you're going to need to see the requisition officer, Corporal Driscoll. He'll he'll give you items to help you on your mission using the same interface used here. Why don't you ask for a starter sapling? Right click until you get to the crew menu. Uh click on the supplier and enter Driscoll's menu. Ask for a sapling from him. Okay. So I believe if we right click until we get to here, the supplier, open up, sapling. Oh, you completed that. So this is an oak sapling, I guess, right? Okay. I got one too. I'm not sure if I got one. I think you just got one. Oh, I did? Okay. Yeah. Okay, well, let's do our uh, quests while, he, while we're waiting. Okay, I got the bone meal. Oh, I like that. I forgot about that sound. And so I, I have bone meal here, tentacles. so if you place down a tree, yeah. Okay. Uh, and let's try not to do it in a way that breaks the glass. Ooh, I got an apple. Nice. <laughs> I'm going to make some crafting tables then, or a crafting table for the quest, and I'll place it down. Yeah, make sure you only follow the quests. Like, don't just do stuff unnecessarily. I'm going to stare into the void of... That's a new... I like that sound. Um, tutorials, please. Select task. There we go. Let's let's listen to this. Um, executive mandate two five. I mean two six two five B prohibits the construction of inferior tools you might be used to. Instead, you'll have to build the modular tools invented by Doctor Dio. I'll talk you through the process if you'd like. Just register for the tutorials uh, by sending me, say, a dirt block. Okay, I'll grab the dirt block, and we okay. can register for the uh, tutorials with the dirt block. Also, I just hurt myself. Um, they commented not to do that. Whoops. Now let's work on uh, Dr. Dio's tools, because we have that. Okay. To make tools, you'll need some specialized equipment. First, you'll need a number of blank patterns, at least four. If you need to know how to build something, type the name of any object into the search bar at the bottom of your inventory screen. Then click on the block you want to know about. Okay, so you have the wood. You got the um. Yeah, it's in my table. Okay, oh, uh, pattern. So we need wood and sticks to make the pattern. How are our uh, quests going? I'm um, working on them, getting through them. Okay, are you building tools now? Is that what you're up to? Yeah, I'm going to 
We're gonna need more wood to make those parts. If you wanna get that wood, I'll make the patterns for them. Okay, I'm gonna work on our um, other ones. If you really need food, we can give you some dehydrated meat from the uh, ship stores. This doesn't impress the leadership, of course, but neither does starving to death and requesting a clone. And no, we can't make it to taste any better. Well, let, let, let's let's first make a uh, chest so that we can pool our resources efficiently. Um, no. Here's a chest. So, and any unused junk, just throw it in here. Um, I had planted it over here. Uh, don't don't touch it to our tree because I think when it breaks our tree, it starts to uh, let the stuff in. I'm also, just gonna put it I into the the, the chest. I need oh, the we food also got bar. an eggplant. Oh, here, I'm putting it in the chest, too. We also have an eggplant now. An eggplant seed. Nice, nice. Okay, uh, by the way, guys, we, oh, the don't don't break down. any um don't break any grass or um or dead bushes. Because those give us uh seeds and stuff. Oh, is I'm if I'm not mistaken, the black one with green dots is a creeper, right? Uh, the green one with black dots. Oh, well, I have a black one with green dots. Oh. You want to put down more saplings? Because I'm going to need a little bit more wood to make the next stage or the next part for the thing. Okie dokie. Shall we test it There's to see another... if it's a good? Because I can't see it on here, I don't think. I wouldn't risk it. Because we already know now that, uh, that you can get aggressive things. Aggressive. Mm, yeah, it's true. There's another tree over there, by the way, if you need it. I also got a, um, I think I got a spruce sapling now. Okay, let's put the food bars in there. Uh, we have a sapling bag and a seed bag. So, seed, oh, nice. Sapling, uh, bag. Oh, we got a pig. Oh, got uh, a pig, yay. Where do we want to keep our pig? Let's make a fence. Fence onto a wall. Actually, no, wait, don't fence them to a wall. We don't know if it can attack mobs through a wall. Yeah, we don't want the uh, the stuff to infect him. So maybe do it one block away from the wall to be safer. Yeah. I mean, out of the can way, but... Yeah. Then, we, then if we get another pig, we can breed it. Yes. Let's try to keep Man, our stuff we... organized here, by the way. Who is sawing? I got a pickaxe and a mattock now. Oh, Ooh, nice. I'm gonna see if I can get those books like that, if I'm not mistaken. It's like the, um, these ones down here. The, um, that one. Is that a fence, really? Uh, I believe this was... Yeah, that one. It might be the old recipe for a fence. And that one. I got the books for the Tinker's Construct stuff. Okay. Um, okay, I'll make you guys, uh, I'll get some stone, and I'll see if I can get some stone. Tinkers yeah, try to get a hatchet stuff. or an that axe. That sounds good. I mean, there's so many also, the wooden mattock. Uh, focus on the quests. They describe, uh, how to get stone and other stuff. Like, it's, it's really... I believe the wooden mattock is really good at these kinds of things. Like, Lucas, if you hold this and you look at something and it says uh, currently harvestable, it'll tell you yeah. that uh, that that thing is harvestable by okay. the uh, tool. Here, if not, tool it'll just break. Also a shovel. Do you want to come here and get the flint? Because that would be the next step. Right. Let me sleep, game. It is obviously nighttime. Let me sleep. <laughs> Okay, hopefully our pig is safe in here. Okay. Uh, Lucas, you want to sleep? Sure, one second. I'm just grabbing the last piece of flint. I'm going to work on the farming tasks uh, when we need those. Okay. And I'm also going to plant a tree here. you seriously place gravel above your head? I didn't mean to. Okay. So, here's your gravel. Um. 
Every day you can claim... Okay, let's turn that down a little. But every day you can claim new rewards uh, in here. Saplings, seeds, animals. Oh, we got another pig. Now we can breed them. Okay, let's try harvesting our grass. There we go. We got a seed out of that and another. Make sure we get enough seeds to start uh, farming. I mean, it's going to make the place look pretty bare without any grass, but... Eh, whatever. We have Wait, a rubber sapling. Wait, let me up game. Am I... Is that grass... Like, pure grass outside of the dome? Oh. Oh, guys. So, you know how you get your re daily rewards? Yep. It reflects poorly on your mission outlook. Oh. So we're currently at a very poor mission outlook uh, right well, now. Well, at least we got a pig. At least we have a pig. And if we reach too low, we get cancelled. So we need to do well. Well, how else are we supposed to get another pig? <laughs> yeah. Honestly. Oh, wait, we have two pigs. Wait, when did we get a second pig? Uh, we got another. Huh. I love how they're both named Spawn. Yeah, we got Netherrack. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so let's stop asking for things from these people using the supplier. Yeah, because that doesn't Because evidently seem like that doesn't idea. do too well for us. Okay, so Lucas, you're working on mining. I'll work on the farming tasks here. So... Okay. Uh, because we do? expected this land would be fertile, our ready-to-eat stores are limited. Corporal Driscoll can give you access to emergency rations. Uh, but if we intend to establish a permanent presence here, we'll need to set up a stable food supply. See if you can get a farm going. We've got some seeds here on the Jaded if you need them, but we're hoping the land is fertile enough that you could find some seeds in nearby grass. Send us a loaf of fresh-baked bread. Um... When you have one to spare, fresh food will lighten the morale of the whole crew to prove the leadership of the jaded that the settlement has hope. Okie dokie. Transporter beacons. Um, register a team beta. Okay, completed. This one. Learn earning scout. Learning to scout. Uh, don't do that one. Don't do that one. Okay, never mind then. I'm just going to back out of that. What am I supposed to do then? Uh, learning to scout is basically going out there and dealing okay, with yeah, all the creepy mind, monsters. That's, that's, a, that's a no on me, because I am a potato. Yeah, you're lagging too much to do that one. Um, well, the other ones we have are geologist, and supplier, and the instructor. Or, well, we have the paranormalist, the colonist, the xenobiologist... And those are the only ones that we can actually do. I was about to say, did you just get rid of our water source? No, no, I wouldn't do that. I saw it disappearing and got really concerned. <laughs> did I try the paranormalist? Um, I think they lead into each other, so I'm not sure what we can try. Okay, well, the only other ones that I can do... Because Let's I'm see mistaken. what's available. Um, completed. Um, try the geologist. Okay. Geology. I like rocks. Okay, so those should Ooh. grow. Okay. Um, I mean, we don't okay. really want to use up our bone meal supply too much, but I the think it's probably worth it to make we bread. Have a lot of it, though, like a ton. The stone on this planet is different than what you might be used to. 
However, because we know you will want regular cobblestone, we don't have break it. Right click, way. and it'll pop. We have provided a way for you to transform this new unusual stone into regular cobblestone. You scroll, please. Scroll, please. You may be familiar with. Could you collect me a stone sample by crafting a two by two block of the new cobble to form normal of the new cobble into normal cobble? They say they're oh. not asking for primitive bread, so I have a feeling we're gonna need a furnace. Okay, so I need four blocks of the. Oh, never mind. I have uh, all I the blocks. You some. Yeah, thank you. Bread. I can make you guys some picks too, actually. I need to find the creating thing. Pattern chest? Okay. Nope, not you. So, guys, we need Dental a table? furnace. Not you. We need a for... furnace. Oh, wait, we have a crafting and... table over there. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm very, very not familiar with mods. So, we need a furnace. Um, and some stone smelted in that furnace for a mortar and pestle. So, uh, Lucas, could you actually, do you have patterns, uh, in the pattern chest for, yeah, for a pickaxe? Yeah, there's patterns. Okay. I already got some stone and stuff. I'm making picks for everyone right now, though. Okay, okay. but I have 28 blocks of normal cobblestone. Okay, because I need a uh, pick. So, um, really could you make a right furnace, Fazbear? Okay, really quickly though, I'm gonna um, do the quest book so we don't forget to do that. Yeah. Manual submit. Play reward. I think the water just got sick. Just turned purple. That uh -oh. is. Okay, thank you. What is Flint pickaxe able to get? That's dollar mite. That's basalt. Where should I put the furnace? Put it on the other side of the tree, just over here. Okay. Oh, I found a cave. I've just got us some coal ore. Ooh, nice. nice. I think there was a um, a, there's a coal thing here. Um, it says here we should probably start collect some samples of all the, the common, known non-metal materials such as coal, redstone, or red, just in case this world has any more surprises for us. So we need at least one coal. One redstone, one diamond, one lapis, one iron ore, and one gold ore. So basically, normal metals might make normal ores of Minecraft that can be crafted into anything. Right. Okay. Okay, so, guys. Let's let's make some charcoal so that we can sustainably um sustainably uh fuel our stuff with the uh, wood. Okay. So I to finish the task i need one of every of all those things so i might have to disband that task so i don't have to oh because you picked up the um cobble the coal i was able to do the um things i'm gonna just gonna just i don't know how to get off of the task but okay that should be enough for us to make some i'm looking charcoal. at all these other th oh that's a lot of rocks so the stone in this place merits investigation could you collect samples of each metamorphic rock for me so we need gen who, who put a quest book in the chest i did because it was in the um top row by the way that um that spawn egg in there does not look friendly it doesn't but we need it looks like it says genesis but it's g n e i s s so i'm just gonna call it genesis yeah, Genesis just good, just good. Yeah. Genesis, maybe. Genesis. Okay, Genesis. Colite cobblestone. Marble cobblestone. Um quartz. Okay, I think we need to make the basalt into stone. Quart quartzite. Okay, that works. Green S C H I S T cobblestone. Soapstone. And M Migmati cobblestone. I got a uh, dagger and a throwing knife just in case we. In case we get like attacked. Igneous. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I'm looking to see you if I can, can find... be our assassin. Sounds good. Uh, who broke window? Not me. Uh, look all around. Did something break our glass? 
So I threw a dagger at it, but it didn't break. Ah, okay. That scared me. What's this one? Mass stone sampling. Okay. We should be able to make a mortar pestle. There we go. Now we can grind this up into wheat flour. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, now we have wheat flour, guys. So I believe the quest is to make bread. Mass stone sampling. Detected that the planet you are on, while rich in alien minerals, lacks some comic tech, common tech minerals necessary to produce machinery. You should have no trouble getting iron, but tin, copper, silver, platinum, and nickel are rarer than diamonds. Perhaps we could science to lo use science to locate a few deposits of those rarer minerals for you. If you collect some local cobble and all sex metal samples for me, I can scan them to see what we turn up. Let's start with the cobble. So uh, basically, by the way, we just got bread. Okay, cool. But basically, it's telling us that we need two stacks of cobblestone. What's that stuff? Barley? Oh, it's like wheat. Yeah, I'm okay. See yeah. Any other seeds that we had. See if we can make more food. And our mortar and pestles in there. Uh, coal and charcoal are also in there. We're gonna need another chest. And there's a village just off this way too. Yeah. Let's not explore that till we're better kitted though. Yeah. Well, while we wait for the um, two stacks of cobblestone, can I try doing a different thing of the um, quest book? Um, now we are iron awake. Iron. Okay, yep. can you... Uh, whoop, whoop. I got seven iron. Down a bit. Not down a bit. Still working okay. here. Uh, we definitely need another chest, so I'll get on making that into a double chest. There we go. And there's our double chest. Yeah, there we go. You can sort stuff automatically in columns, rows. Wow, that's nice. There's chest sorting options on double chests. Okay, I'm trying to fix it still. Uh, I can barely hear you, Fazbear, by the way. Yeah, I'm trying to fix it. Um, can we you make me a weapon, uh, Lucas, when you get the chance? Because I want to go out and explore. What do you want? A rapier, short sword, dagger, what are you looking for? We're just gonna try, Probably gonna try just a good weapon that you know of, if you know of one. Okay, I'm going to start out with the scout. Do you want flint um, or stone? I want stone. Learning to scout. It's a hostile, dangerous world out there. And I intend to send you to the far reaches of it. Oh, great. Thanks. Um, before sending you out to the dangerous alien landscape, I want you to have to know a few things so you don't have to figure them out for yourself while being attacked by hostiles. First, let's start with waypoints. When I give you a task, it'll come with a set of coordinates uh, you must travel to. The easiest way to do this is to press B, then copy in the coordinates. This will give you a waypoint on your minimap. Try using that method uh, to navigate to this section of your base, I specify on the right. Please send me a dirt block underneath it. Okay. Select task. Well, I'm going to call you um, L9X. Can you see if you can give me like a stack and a little more of the basalt cobblestone so I can get the one thing of cobblestone done? Okay, so he sure. wants a dirt I'm block. To make the sword for Xander, and then I'll get our aid on that. There okay, we go. Thank you. So I'm I guess I'm going to be doing our scouting. Um. So now we've unlocked travel to swamp. There's a swamp in the mid southwest of the continent. Whoa, cool. that's 745 meters stuff. away. That's really far away. There's something with mine about like a swamp. Um, here, Aru Place. The, uh, under the swamps, it's called Aru Place. I have no idea why, it's sound cool. Try to fix them up. So, if it, it's in the reach of 10 and 40, all just, I need is just one... Just tell me how much you need. Just tell me how much you need. 
Just one RU place. Okay. Or um, you can use for some of Doctor Stress's tasks. It contains an easily attainable alien metal that can mine gold and bitumen. You can craft into rubber. Uh, for some teams, this will be an easy trip. For others, it might be a bit of a hike. Bring a boat. It'll probably help. Uh, because the location is so central, it seems like a good early scouting point for any team. Okay. So we should probably actually travel in a team if Thank possible. You. Uh, Fazbear can stay here, continue doing quests because of his lag issues. Um, make sure to bring a mix of bread and, uh, by the way, your iron's done. Bread an and toast. Because the more the more you eat the same thing, you have uh, issues with uh, you have issues that start with um. I have an apple in the chest. With you basically get sick of it. I okay. think mixing up food groups works too. Yeah. Oh wait, so, you have food for dummies. Can't you do the um thing with the uh? What was it? The cooking table. Okay, so I have two toast. It's gonna harm us, so we need to be uh, careful out there. Uh, Lucas and I can go. Uh, is there, by the way, the iron's in the chest. Is there any way we can uh, make armor yet, or no? I'm uh, not sure. I don't think so. Okay, I'm okay, gonna work yeah, on getting us a boat. Uh, do we need the shovel for the boat? No, we don't. Found this version. But this version, Minecraft is actually smart. Okay, there's your boat. Okay, I'm gonna leave my pickaxe here. I'm gonna take some food. Take a couple I nutrient bars my... as well. Uh, yeah, take I some got... toast and nutrient bars. I believe yeah, there's I... some toast in the furnace. I got bread, uh, snicker bar, apple. Whoops. Like, I have a bit of variation. Right. I'm just gonna be mining underground so I can get my... Okay. Also bring blocks with you. I've regretted not bringing blocks. It's probably easiest to bring some uh, oak blocks. Not my stone, because I need that. Uh, I probably won't need a pick. Uh, am I going to need a pick? I'm probably going to need a pick, actually. Um. Leave the Promethean one, because that's the one that we use to mine iron. Right. Okay, I have a flint pickaxe. What do you repair this with it says okay do flint. we have flint here pass it to me and i can repair it i got one piece okay and i'm not sure if i need my madoc right now oh i picked it up sorry how do we repair stuff because i think i can repair my madoc you just stick it in here and give it a material okay that works. Um, I think I'm pretty well done. So let's add the thing on our quest book. I'm going to see if I can get some better food one sec. Yeah, do you have a... Um, do you have... What's called? Uh, what's it called? Do you have the waypoint set? No, I don't. Oh, one of these things just appeared outside. I now have a stack and 31 of cobblestone. Getting close to... I'm afraid it's going to get close to our... Um... Oh, 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 I wokened it. It's awakening. Oh, oh, oh. You have what awoken the monster. It's putting out weird particles. Oof. What's oh we got grilled eggplant. I came up yeah, here for a little bit of stuff. Uh we also have some barley, but that that's only useful really for making um I also got you some garden. Oh, soup. there they are. These things are really annoying, and there's a hole at the top of our tree which we cannot patch up. So be very careful up there. Well, we have thirty. We have thirty gravel. If we just build up there and buy one block, then we can just block off the top. Well, but I don't know if the tree needs that to keep us safe, and I really don't want to mess around with the tree. Oh, what's that? 
Oh, that's food. Garden, Garden soup. soup. Yum. Yeah, I, need I, just I need food. Thank you. Fazbear, you have a sword, right? Uh, yes, I do. I have the what to call it sword that you also have. Yeah, so if they get in here, just be careful. Dang, and make sure to kill that them. That can be really. That fed me well. Oh, what's uh, that? There's also some cooked eggplant. Okay. Oh, wait. That's nice. Well, I don't, I don't need that right now, so I'll be okay. Yeah, I'm just yeah we're the ones going on the so adventure. Yeah, um, exactly. I'm trying to get a good variation because I'm probably going to need to eat a lot if I'm running. Well, you're also running while being damaged at the same time. Yeah. So, yeah we also have salt, lost, so if you have eat. any recipes with salt, that'll work. Yeah, I'm I... just looking through them right now. Okay, if I'm turning on my brightness, because it's really dark down here. Okay, these things are annoying. Oh, well, that might be a good idea. If I turn on my brightness, then it doesn't have to keep it all dark. I think it's time to head out, Lucas. Are you ready with your boat and your food and your blocks? Just one sec. I'm going to see if there's one more thing I can make before the boat. Okay. Okay, those spiders need to really, like, go away. Here, I'm gonna lure them to the door and see if I can deal with them here. Hey, hey guys. Okay, if, if you make them fall, they... I'm just going back into my hole so I can mine. Okay, I just got hit by one. They hit hard. They hit a couple hearts. And don't get hit by them. Okay, those are gone. There's only one left. Come on, buddy. Anybody have any apples? Wait. There was an apple in the chest. Lucas. <laughs> Ow. What's up? Guess what you can use the uh, sword for? Dashing forward? Yeah. Okay, what? I realize oh, yeah. I can also throw my dagger. So I got a throwing dagger and throwing knives. Uh, you have a bit of stone in here. Yeah, I know. Dang, that does shoot you forward. Okay, be careful of the animals, because the animals will kill you. Uh, and also well, I believe there are hunters out here that just want to kill you. you. do not die. Because if you die, you were can, you are going to encounter a corrupted version of yourself. Yeah. If something kills you, you become a corpse. That walks around. Well, unless it was a tentacle monster, because I don't think a tentacle monster made a evil copy of. Is that a baby? Baby what? Spider thing. Oh, I think they're all baby spiders because they're all tiny. I killed it. There's well, some whatever. string on top of our roof, so I'm gonna go get that. I think they'd all be babies because technically, if you think about it, you're disrupting their egg sac. Ugh. I got the string. That that disgusting. Yeah. Hey, we got some string now. Only there's a way to implement white ball into the um apples? Uh oh, hey, no, but we can ore. get some. I knew ore here. This is why. Oh, found salt. I found salt. Is that apple juice? Yeah, you just get a juicer and an apple, and it counts as a different food. Can you get eggplant juice? I don't believe so. I'm just, like, eggplant. looking through for Yum. the simplest recipes I can find to see, like, what variation I can make right now. Because I think the more I can change it up, the more it'll benefit us. Because the more we salt. eat the same stuff, the worse it is. Okay, because I have some really high saturation right now, so I'm going to try not yeah. to run around. Anyone need five salts? Salt? Uh, we can just put the salt up in the chest. Okay, let me just make my way up. Again. I mean, we don't want to kill the pigs. So do we have any wheat that we can breed them with? Wheat or barley? There's some barley. Do the pigs eat? Or do no, they only eat carrots? What you could do is you could um, bring a cobble. You could bring the furnace with you since I don't really need to eat anything right now. And I don't think we're going to need the furnace for anything. 
we're mainly but if you just kill gonna a pig along the way like if you kill a corrupted pig along the way then you can use that to make a um whatchamacallit actually when you kill a uh, corrupted pig it gives you uh, tentacles ew yeah are we breeding these pigs yeah we're gonna breed them with uh love. carrots if we can get carrots oh, okay bringing them with love maybe we should adventure in the direction of the village then see if there's any carrots yeah so let's let's go in the village uh avoid okay. everything we can try to walk not sprint um and we're going to also have to go to the waypoint that we were checking so I guess we can go to the village, and then the waypoint can be a uh, adventure for the next video. Okay. Ow. Okay. Down here. Hey, at least so there's some cotton. Hunger. It said as long as you're higher hunger, then you won't get damaged from walking on the stuff. Oh. Oh, you you get damaged. It's just as long as you're high with hunger, you're not gonna die. See, I just got some goop from the sheep. Um. Lucas, are you... Yeah, don't go near those. I am on half a heart. At least we keep our items. Yeah. Um, but we have to fight each other. I mean, we have to fight e ourselves. So stay away from the, uh, the sheep. Oh, great. Here, here I am. Infected Xander. Um, I'm going to see if I can get inside one of these houses. Oh, there's a guard here. Oh, dang. Yep. Those guards are really powerful. Can we make stuff like shields? Okay, these sheep are obnoxious. Oh, there's clouds of stuff that follow you around. Oh, oh, that guy's there. Let's get inside. Close the door. Villager, really? Villagers attack you, great. Oh, no. Okay, so this is really not... I was, I was on the roof of one of the houses, and they do have a fully set up tinker's forge there okay so if on one of our future adventures if we can take that back here that would be right i'm getting hit by everything these sheep are really annoying we need something better to attack them with okay if i get up here i should be fine yeah If I get up onto the here, I'm not going to be attacked. So yeah, I'm fine. As long as I stay up on the roof. Yeah, there's a forge over here. Like a fully equipped Tinker's Forge. So how do I passively take this guy out? That's my question. There's two of them. Hey, whoa. They hurt. They hurt a lot. I need to eat. Okay, let's get some more uh, variants in my diet once I lose my hunger. How much more health do these guys have? Okay, I broke... I killed him. Okay, I killed him. So, Lucas, we're good with those guys. Now all we have to deal with is villagers and other stuff. Also, if you can stay off the taint. What the... Villagers, get back. <clears throat> Dang it. They really attack. Uh, Lucas, watch out for my corpse. Okay. 
I mean, I, I feel like this is going to be a... I, I feel like this is going to be a lot of us just avoiding everything. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to attack these sheep. Oh, a tendril appeared. Great. Lucas, make sure we have enough uh, iron to continue with this, eh? I think I just got infected with something called taint. Okay, let's see if we can... Okay, that sheep's shaking his head at me. These things are creepy. Oh, I'm gonna get butchered here. Okay, these tendrils are also very annoying. They try to reach up and kill you. So I do believe we need to be better kitted to handle this. Regardless, I do think this is time to call it quits. Uh, we will see you in the next episode. Um, and so hopefully explore that village. I don't think we'll make it to the waypoint anytime soon, seeing how hard it is out there to survive. But um, nonetheless, uh, this was a probably a good start, good introduction to the, um, to the series. Uh, thank you all for uh, watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment. Uh, dislike if you dislike the video. That's all we have for you today. Thank you all for watching again, and we will see you later.